Si, how are you today? I'm good, I'm very good. A little weary, but uh, my wrist is a little weary, but yeah. all the better for that. I've had a very enjoyable time. Lots of nice people come to see me and see me. Do you, do you do a lot of these events? Or no, you are? not a great many, but I'm very happy to come and do them. They're lovely. They're, I think it's a situation in which everybody wins. The actors win because they meet the, the fans and, uh, and they collect some money. And the fans like to meet the actors and don't mind giving them too much money. <laughs> Uh, well, what, what are your sort of best memories from, from the Bond era? Well, I can remember thinking, where on earth's the stage? It was at Pinewood. <coughs> it was only a day. And uh, I thought, well, which stage it is? I thought, I know. I'll look for some sand. And uh, so I was walking along the roads of Pinewood, and there was some sand, and that was the stage. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah. Um, uh, I mean, in your life, you've had um, a, a prolific career. How, what's the, you know, does, where does Bond come in terms of? Um, well, it was only one day, uh, uh, but it was a very vivid day, and Roger Moore was very nice, and, uh, and it was a, a, it was a very enjoyable uh, day to, to film. But I can't say that it was the most startling <laughs> period of my career. <laughs> I can't remember really what. Which was, I suppose, right at the very beginning when I was at Stratford with Loris and Olivier and Amy and his Evans and, and a great team of wonderful actors that, was, that stood out, that still stands out. And when I played Elliot Chase in Private Lives, the Duke of York's and uh, Noel Cowell came to see it, that stands out. Um, it's all been very, very jolly and very, very nice and long may it continue. Well, well thank you very much for your time and um, yeah. long may it continue, you're right. Thank you very much. Thank you.